Hello everyone, uh, Snipe Trading here. Uh, today it's Wednesday, June 12th. I'll be going over my recap for today. Um, so today I just uh, did one trade today um, on VUZY and sometimes that's all you need to make your day. So um, today um, in the morning there wasn't any uh, great A plus setups. Uh, I feel like a lot of uh, runners were just uh, chasing and there was um, not really much setup on the short side for most of the stocks here. Um, so um, I had borrows on HJLI in the morning. I was watching this, um, but it it had a one minute trigger here, um, and then it kind of had this uh, pattern uh, on the five minute, but then on the fifteen minute it was really overextended. Um, this also had like a sec an offering out at one dollar seventy five cents, uh, but somehow it went all the way up to worth of three dollars during that news. Uh, but it ended up just fading back down to a buck. Uh, so, VUZY, um, what I saw here was um, it was a three day runner, so three green days. And usually the third day, um, it might have a parabolic move like this, and we'll have an opportunity for a, a short play. So, what I saw here was this. Um, so this actually didn't have a one minute trigger. I was watching this here during this time. Uh, I was way hoping for another bounce here for a, for a short trigger. If it was a few more minutes. Um, but what ended up happening was it just pushed right through. Um, and then on the five minute, I was also waiting for the five minute trigger. Um, but it actually just push uh drop right through it so when i was looking at the chart it was holding a 50 minute so it respected the 50 minute trend and then you can see it had this uh cup and handle right here and then it broke so that 410 area was the key area uh so you can see this is a huge cup and handle 410 area and then um and then you can see on the 15 minute, it ended up breaking the trend there. So that's where I started my short. And then I added more when it broke the 410 key area. And I had uh, um, orders out uh, and it just filled me instantly during this big drop here, uh, which I didn't expect to get filled that quickly, but end up filling uh, all my position there um, for $124 for today. Um, so today I really stayed on my hands, um, and not to over trade, um, wait for the key setups to happen and it can end up being a big trade for you. Um, it's all about quality, not quantity. Uh, so as always, if you enjoy my content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I try to make videos, um, on my recap. Um, either a winning or a losing trade. So, um, thank you. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.